Melania steals the show in dollars 4K glittering gown as she leads the president, Baron, Ivanka and the rest of the family at dollars 758 head March a Lago New Year's Eve bash. Melania Trump was the toast of March a Lago on Sunday night as she stole the show in a stunning $4,000 pink gown as she and the rest of the Trump clan arrived at their annual New Year's Eve bash. The president, Melania and 11-year-old Barrett dressed to the nines for the gala taking place inside the Donald J. Trump Grand Ballroom Sunday evening. Melania donned a gorgeous $4,000 floral embroidered sequin REM gown, while the president and his son sported black type. Ivanka, Jared and their two children, Arabella, 6, and Joseph, 4, smiled for the camera in a cute Instagram snapshot before taking to the red carpet. Happy New Year's Eve! XX, Ivanka wrote in the picture post, where she is shown wearing a sparkly David Como number. Meanwhile, Clara Trump took to social media to share a sweet photo of herself and Eric on the red carpet. Thank you, 2017. Hello 2018, Clara said. She chose a Kiorboni like a deep robe plunging black bodysuit, and Eric, a black suit and white bow tie. During the red carpet event, President Trump promised 2018 will be a fantastic year, while telling reporters, stock market I think is going to continue to go up, companies are going to continue to come into the country. Hours prior, he took to Twitter writing, as our country rapidly grows stronger and smarter, I want to wish all of my friends, supporters, enemies, haters, and even the very dishonest fake news media, the happy and healthy new year, the president wrote. 2018 will be a great year for America. His $758 head party has prompted criticism, with some accusing him of profiting from public office with the very planned New Year's Eve event. Trump has attended the party at his March a Lago private club for the past two decades, but Sunday night's festivities will be his first as president. The president's supporters and members of his private club say the increased security measures and pricier tickets will be worth it. It's a very planned night. I think everyone is even more excited this year than last year, because then he was president-elect, he hadn't been sworn in, supporter Tony Holt Kramer told the Washington Post. But critics claim the lavish party is a way for Trump to promote his brand, even though he gave up running his hotel and real estate business when he was elected. He still owns various properties, including March A. Lago. The president continues to find ways to profit from public office by exploiting the fact that there are people who will pay to spend time with him and to be seen with him, according to Kathleen Clark, who is a government ethics expert at the Washington University School of Law. Hundreds of people are expected to show up for the red carpet extravaganza, which usually includes cocktails, hors d'oeuvres, a four-course dinner and entertainment. The official menu includes a first course of Trump's iceberg wedge salad with Roquefort, grape tomatoes, bacon, red onion and assorted dinner rolls. The second course is main lobster ravioli with fennel muslin, olive, citrus virtues sauce, Fox White House producer Finn Bilmes explained of the menu. For the entree, the Trumps will serve sliced tenderloin and pan-seared sea base with taro root puree, morel mushrooms, roasted heirloom carrots, sweet cherries and burgundy juice. At least 600 people attended last year's sell-out party when tickets were $525 for members and $575 for guests. This year, tickets have jumped to the whopping $750 for guests and $600 for members. I expect most of the members will want to be there. It's going to be fabulous, Kramer said. She added that the president would likely be the last one to leave the party, and the first one up in the morning, tweeting. Lucky for us, he doesn't need a lot of sleep. Also among the Sunday festivities, Donald Trump Jr. celebrated his 40th birthday. The father of five was seen beaming while on the beach earlier in the day with his son, Donald Trump by I. I. Kate, Spencer, five, and his youngest daughter, Chloe, three. The happy family ran in the sand, built sand castles and played football with guests at the resort in West Palm Beach. March A. Lago has been named the first family's winter White House. 